Hey you guys, it's me Thomas number one fan two thousand three here. So um today well I reviewed these new Thomas coloring sets earlier today. But I said in the video that I had another thing to show you guys. I love how this comes with two screens. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry about that. So anyways, I got another thing from my mommy in the mail today. Just to let you know, those coloring sets were not it. So, well, they are some things I got from the mail, but those were not the, the only things I got. I also got Thomas the Tank Engine, the very first stories by the Reverend W. Audrey. And if you guys can tell, this little logo here says 70. Because this is from the 70th anniversary of Thomas. So, yep. This is a very big book. Well, and this book is really special because it has one of those, like, paper cover thingies. Whatever the heck you want to call them. So, yep. So, let's just review the cover first here. So it says, Thomas the Tank Engine, the very first stories by the Reverend W. Audrey with the classic original illustrations by Reginald Delby. I think that's how you pronounce his last name. I, I D K, but. And I D K stands for I don't know. So, <laughs> yes. And, yep, there's Thomas and Gordon, Thomas's train, Thomas and the trucks, and Thomas and the breakdown train. And this book was uh, $17 on eBay. And since this book has like a paper cover, I'll show you the actual cover soon. Not right now, though. So here's Thomas. And then there's a picture of Thomas, Edward, and Gordon. And then there's the map of Sodor. With all the engines. There's even Doc and Mavis. <laughs> okay. So, I don't know if you can see, but there's a railroad crossing sign. And it says, Thomas and Friends. So, yep, and... <clears throat> And then it says, originally, um, 1946 published. And this was by Random House. Random House made the book. Okay. And then right here is a picture of CGI Thomas. And it says, established 1945 Thomas Original. And then Thomas the Tank Engine. Yep, it only comes with four stories in this book. And then here's the Reverend W. Altry special note for Christopher. Dear Christopher, here is your friend Thomas the Tank Engine. He wanted to come out of a station yard and see the world. These stories tell you how he did it. I hope you will like them because you helped me to make them. Your loving daddy. Oh, that was a sweet little note. Alright. So, Wilbur Audrey wrote that for Christopher Audrey. Because, yeah. So, here's Thomas and Gordon. There's a picture of Thomas and his, like, old artwork. Like, back when they didn't even like invent the TV show yet. Okay. <clears throat> so then there's Gordon and then there's Thomas and Gordon and Gordon's like oh! and Thomas like ooh like that or something. And Gordon's like oh! like that. It's pretty funny. And then Thomas in the first picture is like, Oh, I'm ready to shun some freight cars. And then in that, in that picture Thomas is like Oh, and that's actually me whenever I get tired and stuff. And then there's his, like, guard person. <laughs> Wait, did I miss a page, though? No, I don't think I did. 
And anyways, there's Thomas on in the coaches for Gordon, and Gordon's like, hurry up, Thomas! And then there's Gordon when he, um, gets coupled up to the coaches. And then Sir Topham has like, no, 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 no! <laughs> it's really funny, and then... There's Thomas speeding, um, with the coaches because, well, Gordon forgot uh, to let Thomas get uncoupled. <clears throat> And then there's Gordon, and you're like, ha, ah, ah, ha, ah, ah, ha, ah. ha, and Tom was like, oh, 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 like, like, you know. And then there's the last pick. He's winking. And then there's Thomas's train with poor, sick old Henry, and Henry used to be blue in the railway series. Mm-hmm. There's Thomas with Henry's coaches. There's Thomas pulling away with with Henry's coaches. Yeah. Well, well, in that picture, he's not exactly pulling away with them. He's waiting with them for the passengers to get in. And then there's Thomas speeding off without the coaches. And then there's Thomas a speeding along. Mm-hmm. And then there's Thomas when he's about ready to like burst into tears. He's like, <gasps> like that. He looks really, really upset. Which is a darn shame if you can even see Thomas is about ready to cry. Oh, don't cry, sweetie. And then there's there are the coaches and all the upset passengers. Are like, this is a horrible railway. We want our money back. And then, oh. Oh yeah, that's the end of the story. Well, and then there's Thomas looking really, really funny. He looks like um somebody who needs braces. And then there's Edward, and then poor sick Henry again. Thomas like shunting a bunch of trucks. <laughs> Thomas pulling the trucks. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> and then Thomas like, oh. And then Thomas like, <laughs> that is so funny. I love that. And then, and then, Sir Topham Hat scolding Thomas. And I believe this is the last story, unfortunately. But, but anyways, Thomas is filling up with water. And he's looking at the breakdown train. And then poor James speeding out of control because of the trucks. And his brakes call him on fire. Okay. And then Thomas getting the breakdown train for James. And then there's poor James after he crashed into the field, but he was like actually derailed. Not like still like standing on the rails, if you get what I mean. Well, he's not on the rails like he's off the rails, but you know what the heck I mean, I hope. Alright, and then there's Thomas puffing his hardest with the troublesome trucks. And then Thomas pulling James. And then Thomas got his own branch line. Yay! Tom Pike got a branch line! <laughs> and that's it. Another map of Sodor. And then, like, a little tiny story here of the Reverend W. Audrey himself. He sadly died in the um late ni 1990s, which is a horrible like thing, because he was the creator of this guy. This guy right here. Yep, and that's my phone. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna show you guys what the book looks like without this thing on it. Oh. No! I wanted it to be a surprise! Hang on. Just pretend you don't know anything, okay? Okay, thank you. Alright. Let's get this baby out here. Oh, 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 oh. I don't want you to see it. Oh, dang it, you can see it. Okay. Oh, I almost got a paper cup because of this dumb paper stuff. Okay. <laughs> well, that's fine. I got a paper cup before. Okay. 
Now here is the actual book. It's very nice and glossy. <laughs> and it says Thomas, the original number one engine. Number one engine. <laughs> and oh yeah, I forgot to show you the spines. See? And then here's this one. And that. There you go. Put that right there. And the back of the book. I quite like this cover a lot better than this. Because you know what stories are in here, and you know that it's from the 70th anniversary of Thomas. Oh, yeah, and I forgot to tell you guys. Um. I don't know if you can tell. I can definitely tell. But, okay. There are like dirt marks. Well, not real dirt marks, but like painted dirt marks. And that actually makes the book look kind of old. Like it's an old book. Which I honestly find very unique. So, yep, and. That's all I want to say for Thomas Tank Engine, the very first stories. I quite like this book because it has the original, like, four of the original, um, really serious stories in them. Which I really, really like. And tell me what you guys think of it. So, yeah, goodbye everybody and have a great day. And peace out. Peace out. Thomas Squishy Face. <laughs> That's a new thing, Thomas Squishy Face, like, for the peace out, like, thing. But peace out. Holding sign with this. My phone. So, yep. My phone case. So, yep. Goodbye!